well picked. You know, the first time I saw you, I thought you were really a good person. But now I know. So you connived with that lawyer to deprive me of having a share in Ezendo's property. Mm. There is no problem about that. But let me give you a piece of advice. Don't try such with my son, Obiora. He is not as soft as I am. If you like, listen. If you don't like, that is your own detriment. I have said my own. What's going on, Mom? Nothing. What's she doing here? Nothing. Did she say anything to you, Mom? A little. A small. Don't worry about it. She's not a bother at all. Share with me. What? Don't worry about her, she's nothing. Problem. What's your problem? I'm asking you for the last time, where's my car? Obi, I'm talking to you, where's my car? Obi, I'm talking to you, where is my car? What is going on here? Mama told Biora. What happened? He went out with my car yesterday, and then he didn't return with it. I'm asking him where my car is and he's not talking to me. Obiora, hmm? where is the car? I sold it. You did what? What did he say? I sold it. Did you hear that, Mom? He sold my car. Why would you do that? What do you mean, why, 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 why would I do that? If you're not so careful, I'll sell you. Everything in this house belongs to me. Whether I sell it or not, it's not what it's business. My car, I sold it. I don't know why you're... Why are you, why you shouting? Obiara, you mad. No, 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 no! I was telling you! Okay. I was telling you! Where the fuck is my car? Oh, no, no, no. Where's my car? Where's my fucking car? Oh shit! He's... He bit me! Obiara! The next place I will bite is your throat. So you won't call Obiara again. Obiara, where's my car? You sold my car! It's okay. I know exactly what to do to you. I'll put you in your place. He's not trying to touch me! This boy is mad. This boy is mad. Obiara, I swear to God, I'm going to put you in your place. Good. I will freaking put you in your place. Good. Come now. Come, come let me put you in your own place. And I bite you. you know. Yes. I'm oh, those boys start creeping, man. Good. I'm going to teach you the lesson. Good. Where go? Next I'll time, I'll send you. Why are you looking? Where go? You're still looking at me. I'll send you. That's your word. Sell it. I will sell you first. Sell your You're watch. not even going to bring good money. Sell you like 5,005. I don't understand. Nothing is working here. I don't know why you brought me to this house. It's not working. I've been trying all I could. I, put, I, mean, I do my best. Nothing works. I ask for this no. I ask for this no. Look at that small one, Ifoma. Sees me as nothing. She practically looks down on me. Obi, you listen. I know it's not going to be easy. But listen, I am the one who planned all these things. And I know how to perfect it. So what you do is just to calm down. Everything will work out fine as planned. But the most important thing here is my own share. How do you get my own part of the share when you have gathered everything for yourself? Uncle, you sound as if giving you your share is a problem. No! Let's get this done. Let's win. I'll give you more than what we what we again. Uh -huh. Now you are talking. Uh, uh, you have hit the nail on the head. Obiora, I assure you everything will work out fine. You don't have problem. Odife, I say so. I, you are in the house already. You are not going out. You are here. You are here. We go. You go. You go. Calm down. 
You're sure? I'm sure I assured you everything will work out fine. We're not wasting time. We'll be all right. Believe me. Believe me. Okay. <laughs> I have something for you. Very, very good. Ah, Obi. Huh? Oh, you, you know, you know, you know what? You always remind me of your mother. Whenever your mother sees me, she like to give me a cold drink to cool down my temper. And that's what we are doing now. Why are we still talking? <laughs> Let's, Let's go inside. But if a waiting you stand to get no up, oh god, waiting be a problem. But look at no wire. Next year you catch a one. Sorry. I was at the back here then making lunch. No problem. And I'm also sorry. I couldn't come to offer my condolence. I am so, so sorry. Your husband was a good man. But he's so gentle, so rest in peace. Amen. Are you done cooking? Are you just here to gossip? Get the food ready. Uh -huh. Uma, I'm surprised to see you here. What's the problem? Odifem, I am here in respect of the role you played in the problem I'm facing in my family and household now. What does that supposed to mean? What does that supposed to mean? And what problem are you talking about? The reason I have to settle disputes, fights, quarrel every day. All because of the son you advised my husband to take in. He's the one causing all these issues, yet you do not want to intervene. Why? Woman, if you have noticed, I'm not a fan of women who think that I equal to men. Really? Yes. Okay. My wife, I don't agree with her time. Or the chance to talk back at me. As that might have spoiled you in the in, in this city. That is why you have the God to come here and start talking anyhow you want. Listen, I will allow this to pass, but I will advise you not to try it another day. I didn't mean to disrespect you. But I want you to really look back into what is happening in your brother's house. Why can't you call your brother's son to order? Rather than you and his mother keep heaping sand around his waist, supporting his radical life. Why can't you call his pay this thing? But you hold join your job. Woman, if you came here to insult me, you leave immediately. What is wrong with you? Why will you come here and talk to me as if I'm one of your sons? Or the children live in the house. What is your problem? Oh, you want me to come and to come and talk to him? If you're a good mother, you have called him to order. And you want us to come and do your job for you. Really? Listen. When you are done here, you know the road. You can leave. Rubbish. If your brother were to be alive, would you do this? To bear with him, I'm Yes. Yet you came to claim your portion in his will. Oh. As if you don't know that he left nothing for me. Rubbish. <laughs> As you they do, I'm say you the sweet to you. As you they do, I'm say you the feel I'm. No forget to say, no cheat the female. Miss Uma, what is your problem? What is it? Can't, can't I sleep again in my house? What is all this? What is it? I'm sorry. You know that something is bothering me and if I don't say it out, I won't be comfortable. My, my, my spirit will be at rest. And what is my business with your evil spirit? If it's at rest or not? It involves you and I want you to listen to me. 
It involves you. It can, your spirit can never involve me. What is it? Uh, it's just about Ezondo's wife's visit today. And what about it? What is your business with that? Uh, I, I want you to look into this matter. You know how uh, uh, Obera was when he was in this village? Eh? I want you to, you owe it to your brother to make sure that his wife and uh, his children doesn't encounter such issues. Please, I want you to look into the matter and intervene, please. Monica, hmm? is that why you woke me up? Hmm. Monica, when did this rubbish start? Sorry. When did you turn out to be my counselor or my advisor? Are you now my spiritual or personal advisor to advise me on what to do? I want not to do. Monica, has he got into this? Monica, carry your Bible and go to church and give thanksgiving. Thank you, your God. That God that you go to church to serve, just go and thank him that I'm in a good mood today. If not, what you will see with your eyes, you will not believe it. What do you call the Banza? What is your problem? Let this never repeat itself again. You don't believe what I'm doing. Get out of my sight! One man is your gift. Ah, no, 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 no. My son, you know I have always supported you, even in the village. My stand hasn't changed. Do what is needful and take what rightly belongs to you. I'm doing my best. Well, Mama, as you can see, I'm not sleeping. I'm not wasting time. I'm thinking about it every day. The fact is just that I can't do anything. If I had access to this house and that of the company, then we won't be having this discussion. But I don't. I don't. I trust you will always find a way around it. Anything you decide to do, I am strongly behind you. All right, mother. I have no choice then than to figure a way out. That's my son. I trust you. height of it. I'm losing it. I don't want to lose my sanity because of of this boy. What is the problem? What happened? Obiora! I was having a meeting in my office with my staff. Obiora burst in from nowhere to announce that he has taken over. What? Yes. He said he's the new boss and the office now belongs to him. I only kept quiet because I didn't want to lose my face before my staff. But when Obira comes back, I'm going to show him that my silence was not cowardice. I swear to God, I will. Honestly, Obiola's is coming too much. What was wrong with that guy? Shut up. What do you know? Fool. My son, come. He will not stop low to his level. Simply because a madman decides to chase you does not mean you will chase the madman back. Because people begin, will begin to think you are swell mad. I don't care anymore, mom. I don't care. Today, I'm going to be madder than that madman. My son, you will care. Because you're my son. What would your father say if he were to be here? Go upstairs, calm yourself down. I will personally speak to Obiara when he comes back. What's the point, mom? He doesn't listen to anyone. It, it, would, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't hurt to try. I'll talk to him. I will. Just calm down. He was good. You didn't. You, you didn't fight back. It was very good. It's okay. Go upstairs. As for you, see that your long mouth. I am going to cut it short. If you don't learn to control it, what is wrong with you? Mother is a madman. That I will slap your face, idiot.
sorry. Can't you knock? Sorry, I didn't know you had company. Go back and knock. Oh, well, please now. Go back and knock. Go back and knock. Knock like a sensible person. Good. Come in. Okay, man. Please watch it told me what happened in the office today. Mm -hmm. Yes, the will states that the office belongs to you. But you know that you're not you're not this kind of person that can be confined in an office space. So I, I feel much as should be allowed to maintain his position as to keep the company afloat. Let him keep running uh, it. That's enough. As irritated that I am, I'm not the type that can be confined in an office space. But your son could. Oh, you came here to tell me to let your son control the company. That's what you came here to tell me. That's not true. Oh, you shut up. Have you forgotten who runs this house now? It's my house, my company. I own everything now. I know, but I'm saying you two can run it together. You must not be, I'm, I'm not saying one person should. But you two, you know, two is better than one. First of all, you came in the middle of me and my little milkshake. Secondly, came to tell me that your son is better than I am. I didn't say that. You didn't say that. I said, you, you know, said, you know. <clears throat> enough. Get out of my room. You show up to eat. Transmission. Where were we? Right here. <laughs> so uh, you, you can see we have nothing to worry about. I'm a changed person. Isn't it obvious? I'm good now. Um, when was the last time you heard something bad about me? I mean, when was the last time someone complained about my character? Uh, Obiara, I was told you went to the office to claim ownership. Oh yes, I went to my office to observe how things are done, you know, investigate, uh, um, you know, just uh, look around and see how things are run there. And, you know, very soon it's going to be my company, so I need to be on track. Your company? Oh, well, yes, I, I went to my, my soon-to-be company. The only thing holding me back is you. Hand over the documents, papers, deeds, everything that... We enable me own the company, and that's it. And the company becomes mine. You see, your bureau. Chief trusted me so much. And that is why he allowed me to take care of all this. You see, I'll be doing him a disservice if I refuse to honor his dying wish. You can see. Such a good man. With a good heart. Barista. Yeah. Chief trusted you. Chief loves me. Very much. Chief is late. He's gone. May his gentle soul rest in peace. Amen. Practice. Wealth. Life. For the living, Chief is gone. Hand over the property to me. Let me have the papers and documents to the company. I will make you rich. Think about that. Uh, madam. Yes, Barrister. If you know very well, you you'd observe I hardly interfere in the family issues. Reason being that I am not in a place to do so. And secondly, 
I don't want anyone to think I'm taking sides. But in my mind, I want to say something. Barista, feel free to say whatever thing you want to say. After all, it's a free world. And your opinion can never be counted against you. Thank you. Welcome. You see, if you ask for my professional advice, I would say, let's allow your stepson have his way. Yes. I mean, let's release all the properties you will to him by your late husband. Marissa, why did you say so? Mm. Knowing the kind of person he is. I... I say so because that would integrate him to make him feel among and then reduce all this animosity between him and his stepbrother. And all honesty, you think that would work? Mm, that yes. boy is an infant, Annabelle. I know, I know, but you see, I, I'm looking at integrating him here. If he's, if we go the way we are now, he will feel left out, and that could generate a lot of animosity in his heart. But if the property will to him by your husband is given to him, it integrates him. He gives him that sense of belonging and reduces the animosity between him and his stepbrother. I think that will work. <laughs> so, baby. Yes, look. Walk around for that. Oh, that's my best. Let them see my asset. Hey, oh. guys. Oh, God, there. Oh, God, there. Hi, P. Oh, go no dog. Oh, I caught him staring at my ass. That yellow one. You got me. Yeah, he was staring at me. You were? Oh, right. Is this how you are? I even thought he winked what at me. You, you were staring at my baby's ass. You know he didn't do that. Wait. Yeah. Of all the places to look. Yes. You're going to leave this house. Yes, because this one you're already looking at the ass and I'm here. What will happen if I'm not around? You leave, you pack her. Let's not go back. Ignore him, baby. Uh -huh. Ignore him. So, baby. Let me walk around so they'll see me. You know what I want to say. Let me not marry him. Wake him. Hi, guys. Take another step. Hi, another guys. Step. Another step. Another step. Ooh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, they pack, they pack, they pack, they pack. Okay, darling. <laughs> Good. So, that's my box, you know. I love you so much. Mm -hmm. So, look around you. Who are they? My family. Here's my stepmother, here's my stepbrother, here's my stepsister. So if you listen very well, if you you see that none of them is really my family. They're all step, 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 steps, which means you're free to step on any of them. Oh, Nothing will happen. I love that. Good. So, step family, this is beautiful Vanessa. But I call her heaven sent because she was sent from heaven to nullify me. My heaven sent. She's my, she's my. Oh my God! I'm getting so emotional. I'm gonna hold you right there. <laughs> so, baby. Yes, love. My family. 
Wink. Hi guys. Uh -huh. Hi guys. Yeah. Family. This is the woman I want to spend the rest of my life with. So I brought her home so that you can meet her and she can meet your people. Good. Without wasting much time, we need to go upstairs and start making babies. Definitely, because no, this is my new home now. Of course. Mm. Give it to me. Mm. Give it to me. Mm. Give it to me. Let's go, sir. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh, I'm coming, baby. I'm coming to you. <laughs> oh. Guys, what? How you see the woman I want to set it down with? The woman you were staring at her eyes. Beautiful, ain't you? Without wasting time, like I said earlier. We need to start making babies. New place, new attitude. So, one would not have enough sleep before being called in this house. You know you're so irresponsible. So irresponsible. Oh. Mom sent for you since, and after an hour you decide to grace us with your present. Clap for yourself. I see you've got nerves. Boldness. Thank you, stars, that we're in the city. If you were in the village, I'll smack the hell out of here. My friend, you cannot do anything. I said you cannot do anything, Ogira. Okay. You can't do nothing. It's okay. It's so early for you two to begin to bicker at each other. Uh, Ogira, I apologize on behalf of myself. Please. Go ahead. Apologies accepted. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. I actually invited you to find out if you really meant what you said last night. I said a lot of things last night. Which one in particular? Okay. Vanessa? Yes. Vanessa. I love Vanessa so much and I intend to get married to her. Do you have a problem with that? You have a very big problem. You have a problem, a big problem with that. Obiara. You see, what my son is trying to say is that, you know, these city girls, they're just looking for a young man to latch on and begin to rip from. You know, this Vanessa girl doesn't look to me like someone that wants to settle down for a good marriage. Marriage is not something you can rush into. Just take your time, pick a good wife, and we'll all support you to marry. So, Vanessa, mm -mm -mm. Hmm. Marriage advisor. Marriage counselor. Marriage instructor. Marriage professor. Is this why you called me out here? To lecture me on marriage. Really? Well, my mind is already made up. I will marry Vanessa and there's nothing anyone can do about it. So either welcome or not, the day I choose to marry. Hey, 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 my friend. Ah. Listen and listen, good. Mm. 
You know, you must be out of your mind to think I will sit back and watch you squander my father's hard and money on some girl you picked on the street. You must think again. You see, my friend. Oh, my brother. It end about muscles. Just a simple fact. I'm your other brother. Which means all of this. What? I'm in charge here. If you don't like it, please yourselves, but my wedding date. Lord, wedding date. Lord, going back to sleep. Wedding date, Lord. Wedding date. Mom, well, that boy is a madman. Just, just, that boy right there is a madman. Just let him. And I should put him in his place. What? You want to kill him? Put him in his place? What if he dies? I don't care. You don't care? That boy is a madman. I'm happy you know he's a madman. So leave it at that. Okay? What's up, bro? What is it now? You walk into my room without knocking and then you're looking at me. Are you a pastor now? Um, I... I came to see you. I'm sorry. Okay? I realized my attitude earlier on was um, uncalled for. And so I came to see you. I'm truly sorry. And I promise it won't happen again. Mr. Macho just said sorry. No, I mean, I mean, I, I saw your mother. She was stressed. I don't want to cause her any pain. All right, I don't want her to go through any stress because of me. And so I am here to tender my humble apologies. Ready to make peace? Yes, I'm ready. You don't look like one who is going to make peace. I see you standing like a good, good boy. The only thing I like about you is that you're smart. But you know I'm smarter. Yes. No problem. All right, you can. You can go. Apologies accepted. Are you sure this apology is from your heart? He'll be asking if it's from his heart. Is the apology from your heart? Of course it's from my heart. Huh? I'm, I'm truly sorry. No, of course it's a safe from my heart. Definitely. From my heart. Uh, say it again. From my heart. Say it again. From my heart. Say one for me. From my heart. Good. So, we're good now. Lovely, lovely. 
play on. Why is your, yours your girlfriend? <coughs> she should be the one helping you like this, not me. Now I'll miss this program now. Just stand up and come and take your I place. want to hold you. Hey, Sugira, please now, just stand up. Uh, why are you stressing me? Oh, man. Don't love, 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 What are you talking about? I am talking about the fact that you and your son gang up and beat my son, then locked him up. Is that what he told you? That is what happened. Were you here? You're saying it with all certainty. Were you here? What would you have done if someone tried to rape your daughter? My son is not a rapist. I agree that my son likes women, but he cannot force himself on a woman. And why do you think I should lie to you? To what end? No, what will I possibly gain by lying against your son? Oh, that matter is, is delicate. That is act of jealousy. Oh, because he owns the whole world. You and your son can't accept the fact that Ezendu left a larger property to my son. Okay. And you want to remove him out of the way. It won't work. It won't. I am sorry you feel this way. But trust me, I have nothing, absolutely nothing against your son. Whatever he told you was a lie. Trust me. That is your problem. Mm. I want you to release my son. Else, you will see trouble. I <laughs> Release my I just want to live my life the way I want it. I just want to flex myself. Live today, forget tomorrow. But someday, just one day, everything will be made known. So, what do you stand to gain? Oh, so what do you stand to gain? Just know that nothing lasts forever. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. So nothing lasts forever. You just wanna rip away, you did not so. Yeah. What a word. You keep pushing things the wrong way. Oh, what a word. No matter what you do, just know that nothing lasts forever. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. So nothing lasts forever. I miss you, I miss you, you're the only one I want, I miss you, I miss you, why did you leave me for this long, hmm? don't do it again, promise, promise, you promise, you promise, what is going on here? Jesus Christ. Mm. 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 I love you. Bobiara. <laughs> mm. Bobiara. What is going on here? What does it look like? We're flying kites. Just look at us. We're, 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 we're having ministration. What does it look like we're doing? Mind your business, woman. Well. Obviously, you're carrying out your business in a public place. Don't you even have a little amount of decency? At least shame. You have a room where you can do whatever thing you choose to do with your life. Yet you, 
You choose to disgrace yourself and this little slut. In a family house. What is wrong with you? What is your problem, Obiora? You want to know my problem? Come out from there, you shameless idiot. What are you doing there? Hey, hold, on. Hold, on. hold on. Hold on, let me handle this. Are you sure? Mm. sure. Nene. Nene. Nene, Nkaku. Nene. Eba kele handenko. Eba kele handenko. It's not your business. You want to know my problem? I'll tell you my problem. My problem is you and your son will never stop prognosing into my business. You want to know my problem? I'll tell you my problem. My problem is you telling me what to do and what not to do, where to stand and where not to stand. That's my problem. You still want to know my problem. My problem is I have everything at my back and call, yet I'm struggling. That is my problem. That's my problem. So just mind your business. Leave me alone. So you think all this you're doing will solve your problem? Is a solution? What, what do you get? Listen, woman, as you can see, I was very, very busy, almost to cloud nine, before you showed up. Excuse me, I have somewhere I was going to before you. <sighs> Never mind. Baby. Yes, no. Maintain your continuity. Definitely. <laughs> yes, me. Oh, oh yes! I just want I to do whatever I want. I just want to do I do I want I do I want I want I I want I Barrister, Obiora. What brings you here? I hope everything is all right. Oh, have you come to read another will? Mm, not really, not really. Actually, I came to see you, but I was told you're not in. I was just on my way out. Thank God you're here. Me. <laughs> oh, wait, my man, Ha! That's... Honey... Why? This wasn't what we agreed on. This wasn't what we talked about. We agreed we are going to grow all together. Where did you go? Where did you leave me all alone? Left me to face all these challenges alone. How do I go on? How do I go on? I am so weak. I don't know how long I'm going to carry on like this. <laughs> Why did you have to go? You told me you're going to come back. You had plans for us and all that. Why? Does that mean you don't love me again? What 
is wrong with you? Why do you switch it off? Vanessa, what is the problem? Did you see the two of us watching this TV you switched off? What is the matter with you? So both of you are here sitting down being idle and useless while the kitchen is empty. No single food in any of the pots in the kitchen. I mean, what will my man eat when he comes back this night? Are you talking to me like that? So you employ chef to come and cook for you. You are the chef, right? And look at these fat rats. How dare okay, you so talk back at me? Just sit. Do you want to hit me? If I slap you, you will turn black. Nonsense. Go, go, go and sit. Don't worry. Nonsense. Just leave her. Vanessa, the kitchen is available for you. Feel free to use the groceries, the foodstuff to prepare anything of your choice for your so-called man. And leave my children and I alone. Like she rightly said, we are not your chef. Is he not your stepson? Shut up. Are you not supposed to cook for him? Please Is he me. not your fiance? Are you mad? So you want me, stainless Vanessa, to go into that kitchen? And Don't talk food. to my mother like that. Who is this one? Are you crazy? Get out. When Obiora comes back, I am going to tell him all this rubbish that transpired. Nonsense. I am your guest and you are supposed to entertain me. You are supposed to entertain me because I am your guest. Lazy ass people. Lazy, lazy. Watching TV all day. Rubbish. Guess kill you there. Look at this old balance in the middle again. Oh, thank you. I don't blame you. Honestly, I don't blame this idiotic girl. I don't blame you. Ha! For my please, unpack the TV. Let's continue from where we start. Don't mind her. Where is that fool? Where is that boy called Obiara? Obiara! Obiara, come down here and face me! Why are you shouting? Why are you back this early? What happened? Mom, where is that fool called Obiara? Where is he? Watch it. Mom! You have no right to address your brother with such foul- He's not my brother! Alright? And today I'm going to show him what stuff I'm made of. I will! Can you calm down? You have not even told me what he did to, to get you this worked up. What happened? Alright. Today I went to the office. Only for the security man to lock me out. Telling me that Obiora ordered him not to let me into the company. Why? Does he know how much I've sacrificed for that company? Why don't you calm down? This thing you just said is not enough to spew such abusive words over your brother. No matter what, he's still your brother. Your blood brother. Mom, I don't understand you just this. On whose side are you on, really? Doesn't matter. With all these things going on, what do you expect me to do? To fight back? Well, if you're not going to fight back, I will fight back. Because obviously, Obiora has beaten more than he can chew. Calm down. Just last week, he hit my car key. I had to pick a bike to work and to do this. I won't let this slide, Mom. I won't. Listen, my son. Let him. Let him continue with whatever thing he's doing. Let him. You know what? Keep your peace talk to yourself. Because I will not let you talk me out of this. I will treat Obura however I deem fit. Alright? I will. I will. Are you walking out of me? Watch it. Yes, come. What's wrong with you? Mom, I'm so sorry. I 
I'm so sorry for my attitude early on. I'm sorry I let my emotions get the best side of me. It's okay. You sit here. It's all right. I understand the way you felt this morning. But you know you're my only son. The only man I look up to in this house. If you decide to change your ways, who do I run to? I know you're hurting so much inside. But trust me, it's okay. Soon as everything will change for the better. Just drinking alone. Can't you offer me something to drink? Look at me. What do you see? A jobless man? No. I don't have time for childish little talks. You have something better to say? Shoot. I'm listening. Uh, hope you're it's almost a month now. I've been waiting to hear from you. I've not had ever anything from you. This is not what I discussed with your mom. What is it you discussed with my mom? What? Obiora, you should remember that I'm the architect of your being here today. You are sojourned in this house. I made it happen. Everything you are enjoying here today, the drink, the affluence, is all because of me. And I have an agreement with your mother. I've been waiting to receive my own part of the bargain, but I've not seen anything. What is going on? Remember, my mother and I were at home doing just fine. You brought the proposition to us. We didn't come to you. We already had a name. We're living large, well-fed, doing good. So, as he stands, I do not owe you anything. Is that what you have to say, Biara? Hope you are listening. Listening and listening good. I did everything I did for you and your mother. Is this how you want to pay me back? Hope you are. Is this how you want to pay me back? Hope you are listening. The retreat of a tiger. Does not mean that he's afraid. He's only trying to bounce back and attack. Hope you are. I will leave, but I will come back and take everything away from you. Oh, shut up. Take your back itself. Get out of my house. Your house. <laughs> hey, what talk when I was on my own house again? Your house, Ubiara. So you don't know who you are. I will get back to you. I will really get back to you. You will see. I cannot they forget it. Let it be quick, As we do one today, waiting for your. I never got your heart today. You have not even made your slip. But if we wait, you stand to get up. Why is this young man behaving like this? After all I did for him and his wretched mother, they decided to sidetrack me. Everything we work together, they're not eating it alone. What is going on? Obiora, when I finish with you, what? 
me go me a be fair. And they were late in the No, it's not. Sorry, I hope you're okay. What is your problem? Why will you scare me like that? Or did they send you to come and torment me too? No, I just have been standing here for some time now. You didn't even know I entered, so... And so? What are you looking for? Did I tell you that I need someone to talk to? Why are you here? Sorry, sorry. Sorry, Inke, go ahead. I don't want you to run mad because of overthinking. What did you say? Hello, Popo. Hey! I don't have one nigga, I don't have one nigga. If your family, your father, your mother, the entire village that will run mad. What is our problem? Hey, get out of here! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Look at the book here. Let, let, let my name run into all of your family. Barista. Yes. It's been a while. Please sit. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah. You just missed my mom. She actually went out to see her. Uh, Mochi, that's not a problem. I came specifically to see you. To see me? I hope there's no problem. Yeah. Mm, you see, I really want to discuss something very important with you. Barista, what is this thing that's so important you want to discuss with me? Yeah, I'm Go ahead, I'm all ears. Yeah, I'm actually, it's about uh, your stepbrother, Obiora. I heard he's taking over the company and uh, denied your access. Barista, did you come here to rob salt on my injuries or you came here to remind me of my problems? Which uh, is it? You see, I came with a solution. Yeah. How much you know your father owns properties here and there, estates scattered everywhere. All right. I will hand over documents to everything he owned, including the ones under my purview. I will hand them over to you. And why do I feel there's a condition attached to this offer? Ah, I see. There is a little condition. Mm. What you know your father is is, is a flamboyant person who owns estates, properties everywhere. And if you, if, if you, if you, if your memory can still serve you right, you know I've been a tenant. I don't own a house of my own. So I'll be very glad if one of the houses in the estate is given to me. I'll be glad. Is that all, Barista? Yeah, that's all. Not asking for too much. That's not so. Wouldn't you like more office space? Or a new car? A laundryman? And maybe a driver? Hmm. Machi, that would be asking for too much. Come on, that would be hacks. I'm not a greedy man. I'm not a greedy man. Well, you're not just greedy, Barista. You're selfish. Is this how you are? You want me to bribe you before you can hand over my father's properties to me? Really? What you I thought we were having an understanding. Now you take your bloody understanding and offer. Out of this house before I do something I will regret all my life. Get out! Uh, I. I. I said. Get out. Now. Watch you. 
This is for your own good and not mine. Think about it. Listen, woman. I'm not here to drink or to play. And you shouldn't turn past that warning to your son. A young boy that sees a snake and starts playing with it, thinking that it's a rope. Hmm. If you don't take time, he will learn his lesson a hard way. Warn your son. Odife, what is the problem now? Why are you so angry? Huh? If your son will be or I think that he can go back on our agreement and sit down to enjoy what I help him to get alone. He's playing. Tell him not to backstrap on our agreement. He should keep to that agreement. Else, I'm passing this warning to you because I know what I can do. But I don't want to do anything without warning you. Warn your son, woman. Warn him because he'll start with him. He won't know what hit him. Odifi, oh, I come and sit down and let us discuss it over now. Hey. This boy will not put me in trouble. Eh? This boy will disgrace me. I have to speak with him because the way Odife is vibrating, and I don't want to lose my son now. I don't want to lose him. I don't. Obiora, this is not something you should take lightly. I know Odife and what he's capable of doing. In fact, I know Odife better than I knew his brother Ezendo. He can go to any length to satisfy his ego. Just settle him, please. Mama, why are you worrying yourself? Who should I be scared of? Odife. <laughs> Mama, please don't make me laugh. Mama, you seem to have forgotten who you're talking to. Forgotten so soon? The only man that comes out of the village square and every masquerade takes to their heel. That's the person you're talking to. Oh, you think the city has changed me? Nah, the city made me stronger. As for Odife, just ignore him. Hmm? The very little issue. Very little issue. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, I am just scared because you are my only son. I won't be happy if anything happens to you. When I know it could be avoided. Mama, nothing can happen to me. Nothing will happen to me. So why are you worrying yourself? Huh? Oh, I'll see Jack and I'll be able. You do for a car. What do I get? Relax, Mama. Don't worry yourself. Good news. I had a meeting with the barrister. Mmm, uh. fair deal. Very soon, Mama. Very, very soon, you and I were swimming, swimming, and money. When you come, was it? Eh? 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 When you come, was it? Very soon, Mama. That is good news. But what did you agree oh, on? Mama, Mama, you worry too much. Hmm? Let me be in charge of that. Mm -hmm. All I need you to do is. Sit back, relax, enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> Mom. Yeah. Mom. What? Mom, there's trouble. Trouble? Yes. What do you mean? What kind of trouble are you talking about? Mom, I just got a call from one of our tenants in Johnson Estate telling me that they've just been notified to leave that's packed out because the new owners of the estate are coming to sell it. What? Who, who, who is the new owner? Who else, Mom? Who else? No. That's big trouble. I tell you, big trouble. What? I can't get this. What is going on? Mom, I don't know. I don't know. The property that you're talking about belongs to me. So I can sell it anytime that I didn't fit. You have no right to ask me. 
Really? La oh yeah, really. Lastly. I never try to stop me again with this nonsense. All right? I still live in here because I consider you my brother. You still have part of the properties because I consider you my brother. Don't let me lose it. Bye, man. Just going for the road. Mm. Oh, Kyrie. Oh, oh my goodness. Kyrie. Kyrie, love. One for the road. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Marissa, what is going on? Are you aware of you have sold one of my late husband's property? Mm. Of course I'm aware. As a matter of fact, I was the one who even helped him get a buyer. What? You did what? You heard me though. Know, said I helped him get a buyer. After all, my father did for you. This is how you pay us back. Huh? Marissa, what are you doing? What happens to my late husband's wish? What about his will? How could you do this? Oh, madam, I expect you to understand. This is a rat race, and I'm not an exception. Even though your son here had uh, taken my offer, I don't think all these would have happened. Oh. Oh, I see. I see. So you're doing all of this because I refuse to bribe you. You did all of this. Is that what you're trying to tell me? 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 No, let me put this guy in his place. Let him be. Oh, did you lose? Rest in peace. I apologize on his behalf. Don't take it to heart, please. I beg you. What in pictures? In my office? It's okay. Trying to strangle me? Listen, madam. If not for the respect I have for Chief, I would have shown this young man the stuff I'm made of. It's okay. Thank you for respecting my husband's wish and his relationship with you. Please, we'll take a look now. This young man here almost trembled me. What, what was the meaning of that? I thought we agreed. That he wouldn't resort to violence. What was that at the barista's office? Well, Mom, I'm sorry. All right? I just couldn't sit back and watch that greedy bastard justify his actions. That man was supposed to be the one we want when we need help. But now look at the way he's changed. Listen, my child. When man fails, we should look up to God who will always intervene in our stead. Well, I'm sorry, Mom. Because before God comes down to this earth to intervene, I will surely deliver my judgment here on earth. Watch. Switch it off. Does this place look like a clubhouse to you? Why would you disturb the whole house with your madness? And what is wrong if I party in my fiance's house? I don't have respect. You even have the knife to smoke in this hotel room. What happens to your manners? Old hag. This is Gen Z generation. Okay? And besides, I am not one of your kids that you can order around. Don't you have a mother where you come from? 
will give you the guts to insult my mother before me and think you go scot free with that. Are you mad? You slapped me. And I will slap you again if you try this nonsense one more time. Bonjour. Don't worry. Obiora must hear of this. Nonsense. She's not mad. Hmm. He's choking. Mom, um, I'm, I'm sorry about that. All right, I, I just couldn't stand the girl from the streets insult my mother right before me. It's okay. I'm actually very proud of you, my son. She deserves everything you give to her. Yes. At least you have taught her to respect her elders. It's okay. Don't take it to heart. Thank you very much, Mom. It's okay. Look at all that nonsense. What? She's smoking and drinking at the same time. Having fun downstairs, having my drink, smoking my thing, playing music and dancing. The next thing, your brother came in and slapped me. Is it beating me, your brother and your stepmom? What did I do to them that made them do that to me? Your brother slapped me so hard. Yes, your brother. Do me a favor. Stop crying. So, where is that magazine you said you were going to show me? That fashion. So, Mother, don't worry, I'll show you this night. Then just go inside, I'll show you. I don't understand. Where is your phone? I'm charging it. I don't get this. Okay! Alright! I see everyone has got balls in this house. What right do you have to, 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 to touch my girl? Huh? What right do you have to touch my girl? I'm asking you a question. What right do you have to touch my girl? Hey. Am I here? Why don't you face me like a man? I'm already talking to you like a man. So what's up? So why did you insult my woman? Well, maybe if you had gotten a better girl, a girl who's well-minded, well-trained, will not be having this conversation. And not that prostitute you brought from God knows where, who has no respect for her elders. Watch it stop. So you're still calling my girl a prostitute? Oh yeah, she's a prostitute. And what the hell are you going to do about that, bro? What am I going to do? Oh yeah. What, what am you going to do? Stop. What you? Fuck. Don't fight. Stop. No, no. Hey. Watch it. Oh. Wait, brother. Wait, 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 no. Get up. No. Get up. He'll not fight. I'm not fight. I will not con I'll control many times. Just wake up, oh mama. Wake up now. If I'm get up now, why are you? Wake up. Wake up. Wake up.
Di mama. Na. Oh. Yeah. Eh, Rock, why? I'll get it. What is your problem? Hey, why are you disturbing my dream this afternoon? Hey, when you were, when you were bad news. I have bad news. Bad news? What hey. bad news? Ah, they say the former is dead. The former? Hey, no, no. Am I supposed to notice the former? Ah, your brother's daughter. Is that why you are working me? Hmm. Is she the first person to die? Uh, and hey, let her die and go and meet her father wherever he is. No. Please don't disturb my sleep. And the worst thing is, they say them Obiora is responsible for her death. Obiora Gouye. What did you just say? Uh, they said Obiora killed her. Obiora did what? Killed her. Who told you? Uh, I don't know. It's what I heard. Are you sure? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. It's all here. Shut Woman. Are you sure you are not sure? Uh, um, it's what they said, though. Eh. Uh, sure. Hope you are the QD for me. Uh, I'm coming. Wait for me. Where to? Where are you going to? Enna, where are you going to? What is this I'm hearing? What is this I'm hearing about your son? I am confused also. Eh? I was calling him, but he's not picking his call. So it is true. It is true. Your son killed my niece. And eh, Madam Gift. Hey! Mbam, bam, 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 bam. My son cannot kill Biko. My son cannot kill anybody. That is not how I raise him, Biko. He might have anger issues. But he is not capable of killing anybody. Listen, Madam Gift, whether capable or not capable, I'm going to find out what really happened. If your son is true that he killed my niece, you are going to go down with him. You will go down with him. You will go down with him. Odife, I have been bearing your threats all this while. All this while, I have been bearing your threats. Look, when the message you. You are pointing finger on me. Who is the master planner? Who is the master planner? Is it not you? Eh? Is it not you? See, let me tell you, anything that happened to me, do you think you will go scot-free? Do you think you will go scot-free? You will not. You are going down with us. You are going down with us, okay, Noya? Madam Gift, look at me very well. I am ready to face the consequences. I will confess of my own side of the, the whole thing. Uh -huh. But you and your son, you people have started enjoying money. Okay. You don't want to release the money. You are eating it alone. You will suffer the more. I'm going to make sure that two of you go down and you will you will suffer for this. You oh, ungrateful you human beings. Eh, Look at you. Eh. You will see what will happen. Oh, oh. You will see what will happen, Marangi. Let us see. Are you not the master planner? Nonsense. your back cause nothing lasts forever yeah. I just wanna live my life the way I want it I just wanna flex myself live today forget tomorrow but someday just one day everything will be made known yeah you love to yes come stop what do you want stop your son is not here what do you want you leave now just sit. I am sorry. Sit down. I am sorry. I am here to offer my condolences. I recently had what happened. I cannot say I understand how you feel, but... Who told you we needed a pity? Where were you when your son was misbehaving? Where were you when he led her to a death? And now you come here, act like you're sorry? Just leave! Now! I am really sorry. I am really sorry. Eh? Obiara didn't mean to hurt your sister. But I am very sorry. Please forgive him. There is nothing to forgive. I don't bear grudges. I don't blame him either. If I would do something like that, I'll first... Blame my son. 
I've accepted to carry my cross all by myself. It's my pain, it's my loss. It's okay. Leave now. When a cobra is forced to a corner, it's forced to strike. Obiora. Obiora. Obiora, you have forced me to take a decision. <laughs> and I want to boldly tell you that this decision will not favor you. It will be your downfall. Well, let me tell you this. This is your bad habit of drinking. It will end your life. By the time I drop this into your drink, you will come back to me and beg. Then I will tell you what you owe. Obiora, I will tell you what you owe. You want to tie with me. Obiora, I want to tie with me. Nyare koko. Obiora, nyare koko. Ma. Agano de forgetti. Echi de quimbeo. As it do one today. Waiting for your turn tomorrow. Baby, what's the problem? Your face is not bright. You look so worried. Talk to me. What is it? I have a lot going through my mind. A lot. I'm trying so hard to fix things, but these people are appearing to be difficult, man. I have to re strategize. Feels like I'm not trying enough. Baby, don't say that. You're strong. Can't you see that your stepmom and your brother always shake when you speak? These people are scared of you. They respect you. Don't ever look down on yourself. Don't think you're lacking anything. That's the point. You're powerful, baby. Say it again. You're the pride of Africa. You're very powerful. My king. Mm. Mm. Okay. I'm powerful. Very powerful. <laughs> Well, I'm not here to fight you. So sit. So what can I do for you? All I to know. How much did Obiora pay you to do this to us? I don't understand. What? Don't you understand? 
I mean, you were practically my father's best friend. He trusted you. Confided in you. And yet, you did all of this to us. Do you know how bad I feel every time I see that idiot insult my mother? You gave him everything. You gave him the company. You gave him the estates. Even if my father signed that, even if he wrote that, he should have at least given us a heads up. So we'll find a way around us. You unleashed a monster and gave him everything he needed to destroy us. <sighs> well, just so you know, everything he does is on you. They also you're doing. And I hope your conscience can take this. What's your problem? Who you be, sir? Who I be? You're asking me who I be. You don't know me. Organo day around. Get out of the road. Organo day around. Go to me, Organo day around. Which organ do you know I'm looking for? You saw Organo day around. There's something wrong with you. I want to see Obiora. Obiora is not here. He's not around. He's not around. You must be crazy. Is that not Obiora there? Is that not Obiora there? Why would you say he's not around? There's something wrong with you. Eh? Go. You are stupid. So, see, there is this um. Hey, I'm so sorry. How many times want you never to let uninvited guests into my house? Are you mad? Do you want to lose your job? What's wrong with you? I'm so sorry. Huh? What is wrong with you? Hey, please. Take a deep breath. I'm the owner of the house. I'm still talking, okay? Stop acting like you know anything. I'm still talking. Did you hear what I said? Yes, yes, sir. Did you understand me? Yes, yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. You let human beings into my house, not balloons. Okay. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Human beings? In. Balloons? Out. Good. In human beings? In. Balloons? Out. Balloons? Out. Human beings? Out. Okay. Okay. Up here! Up here! I'm telling them to go out! Balloons! Don't get out! Get out! Don't touch me! Let me go out! 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 Let me I don't know what you're Get up from this side. Get up from this side. Obiora. What do they go? Get Obiora, am I the one you are doing this to? Balloon. Oh, Obiora. Human beings. Balloons. Obiora, I'm not going to do it. I beg you. Get out. I said, go outside. Don't touch me again. Get out. Come over here. I said, get out. Get out. Get out. Look at get this, this boy. This balloon outside. Get out. In. Balloons. Out. Move. Hey. Move. Get out from this corner. What? Hey, what are you? Get out. Get out. Get out. Look at this boy. Get this corner. I will kill you now. Kill who? I will kill you. Get out of this corner. What is that me? You will see. You say, well, come get out. Get out. Don't touch me again. Balloons. In. Don't touch me again. Get out. In. Out. Come on, move. Come on, get out. Come on, get out. Come on, get out. Go to the grave. Come on, move. Come on, move. Come on, move. In. Out. Come on, get out. Come on, move. In. Balloons. Out. Come in. Uh, 
Hi, what's up, bro? How you doing? What are you doing here? Relax. I'm not here to make troubles, all right? I know your blood is always hot. I said, what are you doing here? All right, fine. Um, is it considering the fact that we don't get to have a normal discussion told us fight, fight, fight all the time? Uh, you probably didn't notice today is my birthday. Yes. And as I clocked another year, I can't stop but imagine how short life is. So why be enemies when we can just be brothers like we're supposed to be? All right, long story short, I came here to say sorry for all, I mean, everything I've done to you. And also hear you say a happy birthday to me as your brother. 